Hey everyone, I'm Oliver, this is Andreas, and we're from UCalab. We're a Berlin-based startup with core competences in artificial intelligence, machine learning, natural language processing, and financial modeling. Over the course of the last years, we have developed a unique artificial language intelligence that automatically reads and interprets financial news in German and English, and detects their impact on the stock market price development for a company, sector, or index. Our solution comprises out of two main components. On one hand, you have the news analyzer, which gives you a structured and evaluated overview of the relevant news. And on the other hand, you have the trend cockpit, which gives you specific investment signals based on the sentiment trend. So let's imagine that I'm a portfolio manager or a client relationship manager struggling to keep up with all the news surrounding the companies in his portfolio and on, on his watch list. He doesn't have the time to read into all the stories and follow all the news for all these companies. Clients keep calling him, asking about new topics and how they might influence their investments. So let me show you how you can use our tool to provide excellent customer advisory and make better informed investment decisions. So every morning on my way to work or during breakfast, I can use this overview uh, to get a quick and efficient glance at the relevant news. I can see which countries, which indices, which sectors, which uh, industries uh, got positive or negative news. I can see the topics at the bottom that are driving the market. And on the left-hand side, I can see the respective articles in German and English. So if I now want to drill down on a specific index of my interest, like the DAX 30, I can click on it, drill down, and I immediately see all the comprising companies see which ones got positive, which ones got negative feedback. And I can even further drill down on BMW on a company level. I see the specific sentiment score of the company. I see the sentiment of the sector and the indices it's included in. And I see the topics uh, that BMW is mentioned in the news with. On the left-hand side, I can uh, read into the articles to get the context of the stories that BMW is mentioned. Or I can use this data graph to visually assess the topic. So in this data graph, I see what companies, persons, and topics are related with each other based on the data we have. So it gives me a, a fresh uh, look at the news and input for potential investment opportunities. If a new topic comes up, I can analyze it in here and see which companies get positive and which ones get negative uh, media coverage, and then I can act accordingly. As a portfolio manager, I can upload my portfolio and my watch list in the tool. So I get the relevant news uh, at a glance. And uh, I can give my clients access to this. So I have a competitive edge in the market because I can give my clients alerts when the sentiment shifts in their portfolio. I can give them regular updates via newsletters about the relevant news uh, around the companies in their portfolio. So often the news sentiment turns before the financial markets do. So in addition to the news analyzer that we just showed you, we also have a trend cockpit in our solution. The trend cockpit gives you alerts, signals, based on, on the company sentiment scores. We aggregate them up for the 19 different economic sectors, which you can see on the left-hand side. And uh, on the right-hand side, uh, we are looking now at the financial service index. You can see the specific exit and entry signals that we provide when the sentiment trend shifts based on the new sentiment. So in addition to these sector signals, uh, we also provide an overlay uh, of our sentiment index where you can benchmark it uh, with different indices. Right now, we're looking at the DAX. Maybe let's switch to the MSCI world. On the right-hand side, the green line represents our sentiment index, and the lower line represents the benchmark. At the bottom, you can see the recommended investment ratio, which bases on the 19 economic sectors I just showed you. So um, you can see transparently our model dates back to 2005, and from 2000 on, uh, 2014 on forward, you can see our out-of-sample performance. So the gap between the two lines represents the outperformance of our sentiment model against the index, which proves the validity of our concept. So at the beginning of this year, the first European equity fund based on sentiment 
on our sentiment signals launched and it shows a pretty impressive performance. In addition to the fund, we also included our signals in a robo-advisor of a Swiss bank uh, and it launched in July this year and was able to significantly uh, improve the risk return rates uh, in every possible scenario. So as you could see in our presentation, uh, the UCLAB solution empowers you to make smarter investment decisions and deliver excellent client advisory based on news topics and market sentiment trends. In addition, the UCLAB solution connects the sentiment with financial models and tells you when the market sentiment trend has reached a turning point and it's time for you to act. So unlike other tools, UCLAB provides fact-based actionable insights that are as easy and clear to understand as invest or divest. So if you would like to try out this tool, please come and see us at our booth. And we're also happy to answer you questions. And uh, if you would like some tasty Swiss chocolate that we brought with us, vote for us as best in show. Thank you very much. <laughs>